Hello Drive Radio fans, Richard Rush here today with Walt McLean behind the camera. Today we're going to take a look at the 2019 Mazda MX-5 RF. This is the Grand Touring Edition. Uh, basically this is the Miata folks with a hard top and it's fantastic. I will just say that. Walt, let's jump right in. Uh, going to be a quick review. It's, it's a little car. Um, they redesigned the Miata and the MX-5 a few years back um, and they really kind of refined and enhanced it the past few years. This is our first um, it, time in this hard top again we've been in the soft tops before worked really nice I like the hard top aspect I like how it's got an actual motorized retractable roof so you don't have to worry about it the only knock I'll, I'll give it Mazda I would love for that retractable roof to be able to be activated at faster than six miles per hour and that is the limit as it currently stands right now. So if you're going faster than six miles per hour, um, you can't do anything with the roof. So whereas I'll be honest, other manufacturers, you can go up to like 25, 30, there may be something due to the size of the vehicle, the mechanisms, but I would love to see that just a little bit higher Mazda in, in our humble opinion. You can see the interior, again, not a whole lot to it. You got some nice leather seats. They are heated, which is really nice, especially if you're driving, maybe a little bit cooler out. You've got speakers integrated into your, um, your headrest, um, obviously, so you can hear people. Even with the top down, the Bluetooth capability still doesn't sound too bad, even going about 55, 60 miles an hour down the highway. Actually tested that out with Walt this past year, or this past week, so that was a really nice feature. This has got the six-speed manual in it. It does come with a automatic transmission, but I'll be honest, half the fun of this Miata is the fact that it's a manual. We'll come around to the back here, Walt, to the to the trunk and show the little portion of this trunk of this vehicle because it is little and it's meant to be. So I'm not going to knock this vehicle for this trunk. That's part of the allure to this car. It's, it's part of those Miata clubs. I mean, you, you just kind of get in here. It's a fun little car to tool around in. About 4.6 cubic feet of trunk room. Differences from last year to this year, about 26 more horsepower on this new model, slight uptick in torque, but not enough to worry about. I'll, I'll be honest with you there. It's a fun vehicle to drive. Um, and actually, while I'm going to show real quick what this car looks like with the top down or up, I should say. So again, only up to six miles per hour. There's a button right down here. We won't show it because it's just kind of an awkward sitting. As it comes and folds up, takes about 15 seconds or so. You guys can even time it on the video itself. Again, there used to be an old latch right here and then now that is done and we'll leave it that way. Um, as far as taller drivers, Walt's about six foot four, six foot five. Um, he's not able to fit in this vehicle, just 100% being honest with you. There's, if you're about 6'1", 6'2", you're gonna be hard pressed to sit in this vehicle or even get in, I should say, without having to lower the top down. It's pretty hard. I'm 5'9", 5'10", fits me perfectly. For those over that, you're gonna kinda struggle a little bit. This vehicle, 26 and 34 for fuel economy, 29 average. I'll be honest, we've actually been able to average 35 miles per gallon. So this vehicle, even with more horsepower, still keeps the same fuel economy, which we love. Base price of this vehicle, 33. 335. It gives you the GTS package for $750, more of a sport tuned suspension, black roof, that sort of thing. An interior package with alloy pedals is $425. Total price on this vehicle, $35,405. Again, this is pretty much top of the line, top of the trim level. What do we think? Well, I think you can tell. This is a blast to drive. It's a fun little car. It's enjoyable. If you're in the market for, you know, a little sedan, an affordable, um, you know, two, or sorry, not a sedan, an affordable Roadster, get out and test drive this because if you've driven an old Mazda and sorry an old Miata you're going to be pleasantly surprised with some of the refinements that they've done on this new version so again 2019 Mazda MX-5 this is the RF version head to your local Mazda dealer test drive it and when you do that let them know that John and Richard Rush from Drive Radio sent you